Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon. Kelsey Anderson reveals true feelings about dad being Golden Bachelor. The Bachelor star, Kelsey Anderson reveals her true feelings about her dad, Mark Anderson, being the next Golden Bachelor. Although Mark has already been through a Bachelor Nation experience by joining the ranks of Joan Vasso's men in the Golden Bachelorette, Kelsey has stated what she thinks about him going on to date multiple women at once. Joan Vasso's didn't believe Mark Anderson was ready. Undoubtedly, Mark Anderson was a fan favorite during the Golden Bachelorette. Ever since Bachelor Nation met Mark on Joey Grisiade's season of The Bachelor, fans fell in love. Since Mark was a very understanding father during the hometowns, when Kelsey Anderson was introducing her man who still had a few other ladies, it was easy to appreciate his gentleness. When he joined Joan Vasso's journey, it was beautiful to see them interacting. But sadly, in the end, Joan sent him home. This came after opening up about his wife visiting him to put her stamp of approval on Joan. Some fans think it was a ploy, but others can't believe how Joan crushed him. Kelsey Anderson reveals true feelings about dad being Golden Bachelor. Although it was heartbreaking for Mark Anderson to be vulnerable only to be dismissed to grow in his journey of grief, Kelsey Anderson was very proud of her dad. But as most kids know, it is hard to see a parent put themselves out there, only to have any kind of rejection. But now, she shares what she thinks about Mark moving forward with Bachelor Nation, if he is offered the Golden Bachelor spot. She says, if that's what he wants to do, I would fully support him. While promoting her partnership with F, Cancer and Little Words Project, Kelsey freely spoke about her dad's journey. She says, I think that my dad has grown so much through this journey of the Golden Bachelorette. So yeah, I would 100% be excited for him and support him. Kelsey Anderson sees how the Golden Bachelorette changed her dad. Although it was difficult to see Mark Anderson grow significantly only to be sent home, Kelsey Anderson admires him for his tender heart. However, she knows firsthand how the process goes. If Joan Vasso's had stronger relationships with the other men, she had to make the tough call to release men along the way. Mark just happened to be one of them. Kelsey says, I think that he grew a lot from it, and I'm just really proud of him. Furthermore, she adds, I'm also really thankful for Joan in helping my dad through all of this. She acknowledges, I know that after he left, he was pretty sad because he did really appreciate Joan, and he really did care for her, so I think he had a hard time leaving. However, she knows he is resilient, but I think that he really valued his experience through it all, and he had the best time. He was like, I made 21 best friends. He had the best time, and I think that it helped him grow a lot with his grieving as well. Tough Pill to Swallow Undeniably, the Golden Bachelorette journey wasn't easy on Mark Anderson, but it was worth it. Having a place to process some of his lingering grief was healthy. Additionally, finding camaraderie with the men was unmatched. But Kelsey Anderson admits something was hard for her to watch. She says, I didn't want to see him kissing somebody. But she laughs explaining, essentially, turn about it fair play. She says, it's funny. But I mean, I'm sure he had the same experience watching me on The Bachelor. So it's all fair. Furthermore, Kelsey Anderson's Bachelor, Joey Graziati gave his thoughts about Mark becoming the next Golden Bachelor. He told Access Hollywood, time will tell. Unmistakably, his bond with Mark is growing. He adds, he deserves nothing but the best. So I'm going to keep supporting him. And if the next chapter brings him the Golden Bachelor, we will both be rooting along with Kelsey and everyone else, I think, in the world. Kelsey Anderson had always been a daddy's girl. From the moment she could walk, she was toddling after her father, Mark Anderson, a man known for his quiet strength and boundless compassion. Growing up, her friends used to swoon over his charm and how he would always go the extra mile for the people he loved. To Kelsey, though, he was just dad, her rock, her role model, 
and the one person who could always bring a sense of calm to her chaotic world. But now, at 32, Kelsey found herself grappling with feelings she never anticipated. Her dad wasn't just her dad anymore, he was the golden bachelor. When Mark first told her he'd been approached by producers of the show, she had laughed it off. Dad, really? A dating show? She had teased, tossing her long blonde hair over her shoulder. You're going to go on national TV and date a bunch of women? Isn't that a little, undadlike? He had smiled at her, the same soft smile that always made her feel like everything would be okay. Kels, it's not like that. I'm just ready to meet someone again. Your mom's been gone a long time now, and this feels like an adventure. Maybe even a way to find love again. That's when the laughter stopped. The mention of her mom always did that. It wasn't that Kelsey didn't want her dad to be happy. Of course she did. After her mom passed away from cancer five years ago, it had been hard for both of them. Kelsey threw herself into her career and her life in the city, while Mark quietly kept to their family home in the suburbs. He never dated, never even talked about the possibility of moving on. Kelsey had assumed he never would. But now, here they were, sitting on her couch, talking about a reality TV show where women would compete for her father's heart. I just don't know how I feel about it, Dad, she admitted, feeling the weight of the conversation settling into her bones. It's weird, right? Watching you date. I mean, I've never even seen you flirt. Mark chuckled softly. It's weird for me too, Kells, believe me. But I think I owe it to myself, and to you, really, to at least try. You and your brother, you're all grown up now. I have a lot of life left to live, and I don't want to do it alone. Kelsey could see the sincerity in his eyes, the hope that had been absent for so long. She sighed, rubbing her temples. I did that, Dad. I do. I just, it's going to be hard, you know. Watching all these women fawn over you, hearing you talk about romance and love, it's going to be so public. Mark nodded, his expression thoughtful. I know it's a lot to take in, but Kelsey, I want you to know, I'm not doing this to replace your mom. No one could ever do that. She was my soulmate, but she's gone, and I've been grieving for a long time. I think she'd want me to find happiness again. The truth of his words hit Kelsey harder than she expected. Deep down, she knew he was right. Her mom had been the most loving, generous person she had ever known. She wouldn't have wanted her dad to spend the rest of his life alone, even if it was hard for Kelsey to imagine him with someone else. I just want you to be careful, she finally said, her voice softening. These shows, they can be brutal. People say horrible things online, and you'll be under so much scrutiny. Mark smiled again, reaching over to take her hand. I've got thick skin, Kells, and besides, no matter what happens, I've got you and your brother. That's all the support I need. Kelsey squeezed his hand, feeling a swell of emotions rising inside her. She wasn't entirely comfortable with the idea of her dad dating on television, but she couldn't deny the glimmer of excitement in his eyes. It had been years since she had seen him this animated about something, and that alone was worth putting her reservations aside. As the weeks passed, Kelsey found herself caught between two worlds. On one hand, she was fiercely protective of her father, terrified of what the media frenzy could do to him. On the other hand, she was curious, who would these women be? Would any of them be worthy of her dad's love? Would they treat him with the same kindness and respect that he had always shown her? When the first episode aired,